Just kidding, you guys can come to my swamp anytime. And today, my swamp is Dear Pip, where I help you figure out life. That's right, I'm gonna be answering your hard-hitting questions and trying to give you some insight. You know, I have some experience in the old life department. I tend to overshare, I'm loud, and I love talking. So let's do this thing. Yeah. <coughs> Question of the day, please. Thank you. All right. Oh, wow, someone's gone to a lot of effort with this one. Okay. This letter is from 1882 and says, to whomever finds this letter, we have been shipwrecked on a desolate island for more than... Yeah, I don't think this one's for me. Okay. Ooh. <gasps> Where's the real question? Let's do this. Ah. <coughs> Message in a bottle theme. <laughs> Doesn't that remind you of, like, getting sauce out at, like, a barbecue <laughs> and it's in a glass and it's like... Love it. What's this one say? <laughs> ah, this one's from Mel. This looks more like it. Dear Pip, how do you get through friend fights that last for months? Hmm. Ooh-wee! Yes, that is a doozy. D-double-O-Z-Y. Friend fights can be so hard. And it's kind of hard for me to give advice to this specific situation because well, I wasn't there, I don't know anyone. I don't know the whole story, but I will try my best. Some friendships are worth fighting for. Aww. Okay, maybe fighting was not a great word to use in this context. Trying your hardest to resolve or working towards. I don't know, not fighting, not like fighting. That was the wrong word, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh boy, semantics, am I right? Oh, I love you guys, thanks for being here. Okay, so firstly, I would say this. If it is truly a cherished and genuine friendship, I would 100% encourage you to try and work it out. Friendships are hard. They go through ups and downs. And it's also harder when you're at school because I feel like everything is just amplified. So everything feels so much more tense and harder. So definitely don't abandon the friendship just yet. Aww. Friendship. Don't let it set sail into the sunset. If you're gonna try and make it work, you need to get your mates, sit them down, and talk about it. Whoa. I know, it's obvious advice. It's an important step of the recovery. All right, so I'm gonna need a volunteer from the audience. Anyone? Anyone? Oh, you? Yes, come on down, yes, welcome, welcome. Ah, oh, thank you for coming on such short notice, Pip. Seriously, you're an angel. All right, so here's what I would say to them. I know we're going through a rough patch, and I really want to talk it out so we can get back to being awesome again. Aww. Let's just put everything else in the past and focus on this. And scene! Yay! Yeah, that was good! It was good, wasn't it? Well done, babe. You really did good. Alright, see you later, mate. Bye, mate. Now that you have set the tone, it's time to sit down and listen and face some ugly truths. Because, TBH, you're probably part of the problem as well. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it's true, it's usually the case. You really need to just listen to them and really take in what they're saying and how they're feeling. And honestly, if this friend fight is going on for months and nothing is changing, then girl, is it worth it? <sighs> Stephanie, I, uh, I haven't seen you for ages. How are you going? Uh, we haven't talked since like six months ago when you stole my hairbrush. Yeah, I really need that back, by the way. So, oh, where are you? hold on, wait up. And maybe you've spoken to them several times and nothing changes. <sighs> Stephanie, <laughs> I really need that hairbrush back, okay? Seriously, I cannot deal with these naughty ringlets anymore. Stephanie, Stephanie, why aren't you listening to me? Yeah, well, if things never seem to improve, you might need to reconsider whether this friendship needs to set sail into the sunset and never return. You know what? Fine! I don't need it! I don't need it! Okay? It's a wig anyway! I don't need your hairbrush! You can keep it! You know what, folks? Sometimes it just be like that, you know? Sometimes you gotta know when to hold them and when to fold them. Oh! I think I have time for one last quick question. All right, this one is from David. And he says, 
What's better on a bacon and egg roll? Tomato sauce or barbecue sauce? All right, David, let's talk about this. Tomato sauce, obviously. All right, well, thank you so much, everyone. I've been Pippa, we'll see you later. Good night, good night. <gasps> oh, you shouldn't have. Oh, thank you, I love you.